Hello there. My name is Coach Jimmy, aka Jimmy Hayes Nelson, and I am about to embark on something that I'm very excited about and pretty nervous about, to be really honest with you. If you'll see here on my hoodie, this is day one of me being a part of a Beachbody Coach test group to go through Sean T's new Insanity Max 30 program. What you may or may not already know is I actually had the privilege of being an original cast member in the original Insanity DVDs. I can't believe that was God, nearly six years ago. And I was so scared and just wanted to keep up and so thankful for an opportunity. And now six years later, to do the next round where Sean's taken these workouts and crammed them into 30 minutes. I'm excited, I'm nervous, I'm ready to dig deep, and I'm ready to max out. I'm gonna encourage you to follow me along on my journey as I go through the next 60 days doing the workouts as hard as I can, trying to max out, and you'll learn more about what that means as you follow me, following the nutrition plan to a T and going all in with this for the next 60 days over the holiday period because I wanna put myself through this as a guinea pig, therefore I can be your coach. I can coach you through this program. So if I can get the best results out of me, then I know I can get the best results for you. So stay tuned, make sure you subscribe, continue to follow so you know all the ins and outs of Insanity Max 30 and how to get the best results for you as well. I look forward to being your coach. Now let's dig deeper and max out. Cardio challenge, here we go. What the hell, Sean T? Hey, Jimmy here, AKA Coach Jimmy, AKA Good Squats from the original Insanity DVDs, but this, this is different worldly, man. I just did my first workout. I maxed out at 14 minutes and 21 seconds on the third round of those in and out ab jacks. Um, man, you know what I noticed about this thing? I started off feeling really good, man. I got this. I may be able to get through this whole thing. Keeping up with the uh, with the cast members there. Great looking cast, they're doing a good job. And I thought, maybe if I could push myself faster than them, that's what I'm gonna do. And I got a little cocky, and the next thing I know, man, I hit this wall. What I noticed about the max out, man, if you will really go hard, and every time I wanted to quit, I didn't want to write that number down, right? I didn't want to write that number down, and I pushed through, and I pushed through. Here's the part that I've got to get better at, is after you take that first break, man, it's a lot easier to take that second, third, fourth, in my case, six extra breaks. Seriously, Nelson? Six extra breaks. i got to be better at that. Um, man, the next 60 days are going to be amazing. I'm scared, but I'm excited. Man, when something pushes you out of your comfort zone, like Insanity Max 30, you know special things are gonna happen in your life because cool things happen outside of our comfort zone. And that just about, it just it didn't just nudge me out of my comfort zone, it threw me off the ship into the waters of uncomfortableness. That makes me excited because I don't know that I can finish it. I don't know that I'll ever get through one of these workouts all the way. If I'm truly pushing myself all the way to the end, I don't know if I'll get through a full 30 minute workout, but that's the goal. And I don't wanna just say that I get through it to get through it. I wanna get through it with max effort not conserving some energy, not trying to wait till the end. So my goal is to push myself. I want performance to be better. I want it as I see that my form gets better. Towards the end, I really did go form over speed because I could feel my form going rough, so I slowed it down because I'd rather do something perfect form a few times than rush through a bunch of things kind of with bad form, not quite as good form. Um, Sean's the greatest motivator because he knows exactly what to say and when to say it to get you through things. The sprints at the end, you know, the, 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 the jack tuck jumps at the end, he always saves like that little bonus, oh my goodness move for the end where he believes in you or he wouldn't put it there. And it's not, hey, we're gonna coast to the end. It's continuing to challenge you as your mind starts wandering towards the end to get your attention, to get it right back in and say, hey, you're not done yet. I found myself a couple times realized that I was kind of coasting and then I look up and I'd see Sean, I'm like, no, I gotta keep that pace, I gotta keep that intensity. So I'm really looking forward to the next 60 days. Day one's in the book, man, I am a sweaty mess. I love the fact that in 30 minutes, that's a full on workout. If you don't pace yourself and you just go after it, just go after it, set your mind right, turn off everything else in the house, focus, it's just you and Sean, and you're gonna see amazing things. I look forward to amazing things. I'm getting this six pack back. I'm looking forward to that. So follow the journey. Coach Jimmy, AKA Good Squats, day one in the books. I'll see you next time. <laughs>